Dear friends, in this video, we will discuss how to execute PostgreSQL queries from Node.js project. I have installed Node.js and I have used Express.js framework in my Node.js project. And I established a connection to the PostgreSQL server and study database using PG NPM package. I am using PostgreSQL Server 15 version. So, let us first discuss the source code. Here, in this db.js file, I imported pg and then using client. Using this client, I give the credentials host, port, database, user, and password to connect to. The PostgreSQL server installed on my system because it is installed on my system, that's why I gave local host as a host. Port number is 5432. I am using study database. I am logged in as a Postgres user and its password is 1234. If you go to this PG admin 4, which is a management tool to interact with PostgreSQL server, you can see that. Under this PostgreSQL 15, we have databases too. Postgres is by default, there is Postgres database. When you install PostgreSQL server on your system, then I created this study database. Then here, I have two schemas, common and public. So, we are going to connect this database, study database from this db.js file, using this db.js file. If you go to package.json, you can see what are the packages I have used. Express is 4.16.1. I have used the PG. Version is 8.10.0. This is my db.js file. Now, if you go to source file, src file, you can see roots.js file. Here, I have declared two roots. Get and forward slash. Then get forward slash set schema if you uh, access uh, just uh, sla forward slash it will return hello technician if you access forward slash set schema it will call this file company dot set schema we can go to definition it will uh, direct us to controllers folder and company dot js file here we print it schema called then we will assign a variable with a value technician variable name is schema name then we will call this user dot set schema function passing this schema name as the parameter then this callback function will also we have passed if you go to user dot set schema let us go to definition we will reach at a models folder and company dot js file here we have set schema method our schema name will come here the name which we pass from this controller company.js file from this set schema method we have schema name we passed it to to this set schema in user dot set schema method this will come in this model set schema method that value will come here and we created a sql query postgres sql query create schema and we will pass the schema name here and using this con object and calling this query method and pass this query set schema query we will pass here and we will execute and result will pass to this callback method callback method is the method which we pass from this function this is the function which we call after get the result so When we uh, let us uh, first let us uh, run the command npm start enter now connected because this db.js file is executed so it is connected we hope we got the connection to the postgresql server and study database using this user and password now uh, we can visit the local host on the browser let us go to google chrome look at here local host 3000 enter Title Hello Technician. This is why we got from uh, this roots because by default in the forward slash it will automatically return 
title tech nursery that is what we see here title tech nursery now if you call this forward slash set schema api endpoint automatically this method will be called this method will uh, console this schema called then uh, the variable will be assigned with the tech nursery value this schema will pass to this set schema method uh, not only this schema name this uh, callback function also will be passed to this set schema method when we go to this definition uh, the variable tech nursery will be assigned to this schema name variable and that method this entire method which we passed to this function will be assigned to this callback uh, variable and uh, we will create a schema create schema with the schema name so uh, when we call this method this query will be create a schema tech nursery because we pass schema name schema name having the value tech nursery so this query will be create a schema tech nursery then using this uh, db file db file we, if you go to this definition this is our db file we already discussed it using this db file this con method we will call con dot query and we will pass this query also create a schema tech nursery query will be passed here after executing this one it will return error and info we will pass this error and info to this callback method this call, uh, callback method is the method which we passed from this function this uh, uh, this from this function set schema schema name and this callback function this callback function is the callback function which is specified here the, the the error and info which is returned from this query method will be passed to this callback function this this error will comes to this error and this uh, info will comes to this data once we uh, return this callback function we will check if error if error is true we will return status false and error with an error field field error if it is success then we will return true value okay so in this uh, query in this function we are trying to create a schema uh, a schema create schema tech nursery okay it's a it's an, a postgresql query like you select a star from particular table insert into a particular table so when you insta when you uh, try to understand this uh, how it works in node.js as per js project uh, you can use any query here like uh, instead of this create schema uh, tech nursery or you can type uh, uh, select a star from um, star from user table like that so this uh, info will come contain the if there is no error from db side info will contain the details about the user so i am just uh, creating a schema from the query so first let, let us discuss here here in the study database we have only two schemas you see schemas two common and public so by executing right now we uh, uh, we uh, run the uh, node.js project express.js framework project we visited local host 3000 but when we uh, call this routes routes means this uh, sl forward slash set schema it should create a schema inside this uh, study database so right now let me refresh the study database let me right click and uh, uh, let me refresh here uh, you look at here schemas only two common and public so let us check let us go to browser and uh, visit that endpoint we are going to visit this endpoint localhost 3000 slash uh, set schema so when you enter you, you know you know look at here status true that means we um, when you call it reach here and it will go to this definition here it will declare a variable and tech nursery will be assigned to schema name and again it will call user dot set schema with this username and passing this uh, function also when you go to this uh, this uh, method let us go to this method here uh, we will create a variable with uh, create a schema and we will give that variable name right now it will be create schema tech nursery and we will console that connection and then we will call query on this con method pass that query and when once this method is executed it will return this uh, callback function like a co error and info this same error and info we will pass this callback method this callback method is the same method here so that error and info will come to this error and data if error we will return status false and error and error dot field error if it is true if, if there is info is 
there it will come to this data variable and we will pass this status uh, true value so uh, uh, from this uh, uh, window we, we understand that we got status true returned from this this clause that means uh, when you visit this uh, pg admin for interface here now it is only uh, two schemas if you refresh it there should be tech necessary. Yes, we successfully created technesary schema also from uh, our Node.js project using Express, Express Framework and uh, PostgreSQL database. We executed one PostgreSQL query, just query. Uh, if you look at here, this is a query. You can use any query here. So, uh, you, I explained my db.js file um, in src folder. I have uh, roots. Then controller folder, I have particular model, company in company.js and a model uh, community.js uh, i am handling my business logic here assigning the variable with the technician schema name and uh, calling uh, model so use a set schema in model.community.js here i execute my database queries and return the result to uh, back to controller and i uh, uh, pass the result from this controller so in this way it's a demo you can use this for your uh, production level projects uh, in this video i just uh, try to explain how to uh, establish a connection to postgresql server database and uh, execute a uh, query from postgres uh, node.js project in postgresql database thank you